Hi guys, welcome back to another video. We're gonna be getting some cleaning done in this video, but before we get started, I've got another great Christmas gift idea for you guys. So I have here a whole bunch of amazing, delicious fudge. This is the original Murdoch's fudge. Today's video is sponsored by the original Murdoch's fudge. I'm gonna tell you guys a little bit like of a backstory about this company, but we have been enjoying this fudge, you guys, this pack right here, the uh, chocolate peanut butter one. When my dad, my stepmom, and Danielle were here staying with us um, during Thanksgiving, we got into this fudge and we were all trying it. This, this peanut butter one is almost gone. It's so, so good. Look at this beautiful gift set. First of all, the packaging is so pretty. I can't wait to dig into this, but I didn't want to until I showed it to you guys how big these pieces of fudge are and how nicely they are wrapped. I feel like anybody that opens this as a gift is gonna be like, yes. So Murdoch's Original Fudge was the first fudge shop, the first original fudge shop on Mackinac. And this is what gave the island its reputation for fudge. This fudge company is family owned and has been handmade since 1887. And if you guys are not familiar with where Mackinac Island is, it is an oasis off the coast of Michigan. Their fudge is made with all natural ingredients and it's always gluten free. They have flavors to accommodate all different tastes and there's seasonal flavors as well, but my favorite favorite is definitely either the chocolate mint or this uh, chocolate peanut butter. There's like real chunks of peanut butter in here. They come with these cute little wooden knives so you can cut pieces of the fudge off. It is so, so good. Berkeley's over here going, yummy in the background. <laughs> You guys can head to originalmurdicsfudge.com slash Kristen Casper and use my promo code, which is Casper, to get $5 flat shipping rate on orders, $45 or more. Um, I'm gonna have all that info linked in the description box and on the screen right here, but I am definitely have been impressed with this company and I love all this stuff. So we're definitely gonna be using this company for some gifts for people in our family this year. But definitely be sure to check it out. I will have all the info in the description box for you guys. Now, we have a whole bunch of cleaning to get done around here today. I feel like that's how it always is, but such is life. So we're gonna get my bathroom clean today. We're gonna get some laundry done. Donnie's gonna help me out cleaning in the kitchen. And I'm going to work on Berkeley's room a little bit. I just did the boys' room yesterday, so I need to pick up her room today and do like the weekly vacuum and wipe down and all of that. So that's what you guys can expect in this video, but we're gonna go ahead and get started getting this house picked up. So let's go. Can you see me shaking? Hear the sound of my heart breaking Bless the soul that's aching Hoping I survive The feeling lingers on Every day of every month Wishing I just could forget about you The way to put my bones Makes it harder to move Alright friends, we got my bed made and my room picked up a little bit so now we're heading into my bathroom. My mirror really needed to be wiped down. There was toothpaste spotter and stuff all over the mirror so I'm just using my spray away glass cleaner and a paper towel to wipe that down and then I'm also going to wipe down the counters and scrub out the sinks. So for the counters I'm just spraying this CLR Active Clear I think is what it's called. It's a just like multi-purpose cleaner. Um, I'm going to spray that all over and just wipe it down and then I have a like dish brush thing that I keep blue dawn dish soap and vinegar in I keep it up in the shower um, I'm gonna use that to scrub out the sinks Every day of every 
Moving on to the toilet in my bathroom. I'm spraying it down with that same CLR cleaner. I'm gonna let that sit for a minute, do its thing. And while I'm waiting for that, I'm just gonna spray down the windowsill up here above the toilet. It was so dusty, but honestly the angle I had the camera, like it didn't even really look that dusty. I should have done a different angle to get the full effect, but it was super dusty. So I wiped that down and then I'm just taking a cleaning rag and I'm gonna wipe down the toilet. Whenever I use these cleaning rags to clean anything, I've told you guys about this before, but in case you're new here, I always take my cleaning rags and I have a dedicated basket in my laundry room that I put cleaning rags in after they've been used. And then I always wash those on the disinfect cycle on my washing machine. Actually, I think it's called sanitize. Yeah, it's called sanitize. So all the cleaning rags go in there. So anyways, clean the toilet and now I'm using my Clorox toilet bowl wand to scrub out the inside. I'm gonna hang up some new hand towels here in my bathroom, grab this dirty laundry that's overflowing and take it into the laundry room. We've got some clean clothes here in the dryer, so I'm gonna pull those out. Got a load in the wash that needs to go into the dryer. You guys know the drill. We're always doing laundry in the Casper house, so today is no different. But do they really daunt us? Your tongue can be sharp. Cut me close to the heart, but we can master the art. And the thing is that these scars are scary, but they Back in my bathroom, I'm just gonna shake off my bath mats here and throw those into my bedroom. Then I'm just drying up the floor right here before I vacuum because under that bath mat, it was a little bit wet. So I am just gonna vacuum in here. I, sh I always think about this after the fact. Next time, I'm gonna remember to show you guys up close and personal again. I have before, but these floors in our bathroom are white, obviously, and they show every little dust, fuzz, hair, everything, and they will always look so dirty like every single day. So I'm just running the vacuum in here. It's hard to tell at this angle, but these floors were so dirty. So vacuum, and then I'm gonna go in with my steam mop. This is my favorite mop to use in my bathroom just because it uses steam. Anything that gets stuck on the floor, it breaks it off really easily, and it just works really, really good. Little essential oils on the mop pad to make everything smell good. Drifted off too far Let's tear down these walls Our destiny has come We're walking down a path So while I was working on cleaning my bathroom, Donnie was working on cleaning the kitchen. So we had the other camera rolling in here and he was in charge of doing all these camera angles by himself, so I'm pretty impressed, but he's unloading the dishwasher, loading the dishwasher. He's also going to be wiping down the stove top and getting that all shined up, and then he's also gonna wipe down all the counters, and he moved the camera around and did all of that, so good job, Donnie. Thank you so much for helping. He's He really is such a like, good sport, and, um, I don't necessarily call it helping whenever he does stuff like this around the house. We just kind of share, you know, like the responsibility for keeping up with things. Um, love that so much. His mama definitely raised him right. Come on, let's rejoice of what will come. I have made the choice of things.
Alright, switching gears back to the camera that I had rolling in my room. I'm getting my mop put away and then I have this basket of laundry that you guys saw me pull out the dryer a little bit ago. So we're going to get this laundry folded now. Everybody's laundry is folded and put away. So now I'm taking Berkeley's laundry that I just folded into her room and I'm gonna get her stuff put away. And like I was telling you guys earlier, I needed to just do a quick wipe down and clean up of her room. I've mentioned this before, but I try to do this like once a week in the kids' rooms, like wipe things down that need to be wiped down and vacuum, make their beds and just spruce up their rooms a little bit. And it makes them happy, so it makes me happy. But I'm just gonna put all of these clean clothes away. She has got a bunch of blankets out from her closet that she pulled out for her baby dolls that she was playing with. Um, so I'm just going to get everything picked up and put away in here, throw away what I need to throw away, and like I said, vacuum. I'm going to wipe down her table that's in the corner, and I'm also going to make her bed and just get her room all picked up. I'll be right here. I swear that I'll stay here with you.
So the last thing that I'm going to do is just run the vacuum here in her room. But that is going to wrap up this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys are having a really good month so far. And I hope your December is treating you well. Don't forget to check the link in the description box. You guys can check out the original Murdix fudge. I'm telling you guys it is so good. It would make such a great gift idea for anybody that you need a gift idea for. But once again, thank you so much for clicking on my videos and watching them and being here to support my channel. It means so much to me. I love making these videos for you guys. Make sure you guys hit that subscribe button so you don't miss out on any of my other videos. And I will see you guys again very soon in my next video. Bye.